All right, hi everybody, and welcome back to part 20 of the Let's Play The Sims 3 all in one, and you're probably wondering what the heck am I looking at? So, I actually moved my Sims and the family to a different world like you guys requested. Um, it was highly requested to move to a different town. People are saying Bridgeport, so I kind of went ahead, because I don't like Bridgeport, I think it's really boring, and I went ahead and went on my Sims reality uh, blog and looked at her or his or their um, worlds and came across Brooklyn Heights and it is gorgeous I will have to show you guys it is kind of like a suburb slash city um, town or neighborhood so here's like the city area and then across the bridge is like the suburb area um, this town did not come populated because I didn't, I didn't take the saved file. I just moved them into it. So what I did was on Twitter, I asked everybody to send me their, um, sims that they wanted to see in my let's play. And I left it up to them to give me sims. So I have quite a few sims. I also imported the, uh, sim and households that were already in like the bin or whatever for the world so i put those in there and we have quite a few people to look for um because over here um i think i believe it's right here i imported probably about seven eight sims into this little house um they're not all loaded up because we need to go here but they're well, they're loading up slowly but surely um these are all sims that people sent to me there are some people or sims that i found on tumblr um like these two sims i found no no the boy i found on uh, tumblr and the girl i believe green sims 2 sent me i believe and this girl was a adult but i turned it into a toddler um and everybody else is loading great awesome um this girl or boy was also from twitter twitter tumblr and tumblr or i made him um but this is the tumblr girl she was actually an adult as well but i made her into a toddler so we could have some kids growing up and stuff like that um and then i created this person a while back he's kind of ugly as a toddler but he gets pretty cute um later on so and also if you guys can't tell marcel has aged up i aged him up beforehand um, and I went ahead and gave him some custom content hair, but, um, to, I'm gonna really butcher, butcher your name, but I'll put your username on the screen to, t to I don't, I'm not even gonna try, uh, her username will be right on the screen right now. Actually gifted me a whole bunch of stuff, which is really awesome. Thank you guys so much. You guys don't have to gift me stuff, but when you guys do, I really appreciate it. She actually gifted me a little boy's hair, which we will see in his um, sleepwear um, here shortly. So he has aged up into a uh, child, and I have also went ahead and went into the options menu and enable or disabled aging and the reason why i did that was because i wanted uh janelle to actually be able to finish her lifetime wish which is um raise five children from babies to teenagers so once uh patricia is a teenager i i i've actually had them try for a baby but i'm not sure if she's pregnant so it's going to be kind of like a hey yeah oh she's pregnant type of thing um because i don't i didn't hear the baby jingles but it's saying i'm not allowed to have any more sims i guess for some reason um so i think she's pregnant but i don't know um and also if you guys can't see patricia actually has some hair um this is actually some custom content hair from a creator that i will probably link in the description below if i remember um anything else i needed to tell you guys I don't remember if there's anything else, but people are saying that this family is just too normal. It is just too normal, which means we are going to stir some things up, all right? Lucas is going to be probably a bi sim, which if you guys know, bi's like girls and boys. So we're going to determine his fate with what, whoever he falls in love with. Um, I have Ariel. I have a plan for him, which we will embark on his plan very shortly. Um, 
And as for everyone else, I do have the portrait panel installed. I do have the careers uh, installed and I'm just waiting for the woohooing mod to be updated. So once the woohooing mod is installed, June will become pregnant. How exciting is all of this? Oh, that was a lot of talking. I am so sorry if you guys didn't enjoy that, but it was something I had to get out. So, Ariel, you, my friend, are going to go over here to their household and actually, oh, where, where is she? I guess no one's home. They always do that. Always do that. I don't know where they could have gone. Seriously. I have no idea where they would, would could have gone. All right. So, he's going to make his way over here and hopefully eventually people will start showing up. He wants to quit his job, but there's no way in heck he's going to quit his job. Um So, I guess we're just going to be sitting here being lame. Go ahead and listen to your tabcast. What skills do you need? Logic. Okay, so go ahead and listen to your logic tabcast for a bit. Aw, it looks like June has really taken a liking to Chloe. She has chosen Chloe as her BFF. Yay, exactly what I wanted. Chloe and June are now best friends forever. And they are considered rich now, which is awesome. Um, I didn't see that coming. But I want to go ahead and actually look into their... Uh, bit. No, 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 no. Their scrapbook, maybe? Okay, so she still has a t cheater reputation, and she has cheated twice. Um, no one else has any reputation, which is perfectly fine. It's fine by me. Um, that's kind of cool. Hmm. Interesting. Not sure. All right. So we're going to go ahead and wait for them to come home or get home. Don't go home. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you are doing, my friend? Out at the park. So which park is she at? That's the question. Um, this is going to be fun. Probably not a fishing pole or anything like that. Let's see. Which park could she have gone to? Because I'm pretty sure there's not just one park in this uh, city. Um... Hmm. I'm not seeing anybody. I have no idea. Maybe here? They seriously go all the way over here, though? That's a good question. No, probably not. All right, well, I guess he can go ahead and come on home. We'll have to go and stop by later or something or just keep watching their house and make sure that he gets there before they leave or something. So I think they're coming back home because it's not saying that they're still at the park. So I went ahead and fast forward time to when they actually got home. So hopefully they're coming home. That'd be cool. Ah, oh, he's a nerd now. Lame sauce. Alright, so it looks like someone's home, or all of them are home. One of the two. So we are going to go ahead and have them come home. Oh, 
or not come home come over fail all right yep they're all coming home yay we're stalking you but it doesn't matter my cat is like sitting here purring inside the microphone i'm sorry if you guys can hear her she needs to go down go down no no <laughs> anaset calm down she's such a scaredy pants all right we have seven days until winter all right yay we are inside of this house i didn't look at this house before i put them in this house so at least they have one crib for the kids to share and they have three beds so i mean that's good at least so we are going to have ariel and this girl her name is ali Koboroto. i think that's how you pronounce her name we will be getting them together. So go do a charming introduction to her. Ooh, are you always in this good of a mood? I would love to hang out and get to know you better. All right, exactly what I wanted. I thought that they would be attracted to her. I don't know that her traits, her lifetime wish. I don't know anything, but we're gonna try and do something with this sim. Um, All right, go ahead and be funny for a bit. Get out of our way, girl. She's so pretty. Whoever created her did amazing, just saying. All right, go ahead and show a funny video. Show internet's cat's video. Is one of them a vampire in this household? I think the blondie, yeah, John or whatever. James, sorry, is a vampire. So he's currently getting ha haunted from him, or hunted. So many baby crying. What a small house for such a big family. My bad. Yay, we're friends. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, ask if single. I know she's single. Um, ask to watch the stars. Uh, compliment appearance. I'm not going to watch the stars. Compliment personality. They, she is single. I knew it. Um, romantic, give, uh, romantic red flowers. Ask sign. Amra's hug. Heat of the moment kiss. I'm getting pretty late. Perhaps it's time to leave. No. No! No! I don't want to leave. You are stupid. Who's taking care of the baby? No one. Lame. Okay, so I guess he will go home, apparently. And no one is taking care of the baby because you're lame. Um, yeah, she's pregnant. Just saying, she's pregnant. She's vomiting now. Alright, so give bottle. Um, hold snuggle oh, I just had a big huge on and play with oh crap and before he goes to bed when he gets home I need him to fill and then turn that on before we forget because that would be super super bad our puppy would go starving Turn on. There we go. Now you can eat the food. Alright, so go ahead and put her back into the crib, even though she's not in the right crib, but that's okay. And he's definitely not in the right bed. You, my friend. You, my friend. Oh, I guess you can sleep in there. I do need to get you your actual bed. They're in the right beds, but 
actually let me go ahead and do this they're still gonna share a room for the time being um we do have an upstairs um so if we need to, if we need be um we will be moving uh around the sims but for right now this will work um let's go ahead and get him a new bed for his room we're gonna go ahead and give him Give him this one. That'll work. For right now, just for right now, I will um, customize it later on, but for right now, that'll be fine. He's already like asleep or awake, so. Oh, and this is the hair before he changes into his everyday. I wanna show you it. This is the hair that she um gifted me so thank you again it's messy messy hair um so he's gonna go ahead and actually just go downstairs and eat something because he does need to go to work or go to school tomorrow so um he needs to go to bed even though he's not going to get much sleep anyways because he does have work in three hours which kind of sucks but that's okay. He'll get a little bit of sleep, maybe. Not really. Probably not. The car's about to come in an hour, so. Um, everyone's super duper hungry, and that's not going to fulfill your hunger, so. Um, go ahead and have a quick meal of cereal. You have a quick meal of yogurt. You can have a quick meal of juice, and you can have cereal. And she's actually cooking breakfast, I believe. So. That works. Sorry about that. I had to take a drink. Alright, so they're going to be all eating and everything. So, eat, um, have a quick meal of bread and jam. Hopefully that will fulfill his hunger. Probably not. I don't know yet, though. And the carpool should be here any minute for him. Yep, there it is. He's gonna be super tired. The bus is here, but I want them to eat something. Of course he wouldn't eat that. She cooked pancakes, so put the pancakes in the fridge so they don't... What? Okay, we... We need to fix this. When he gets home, I'm going to fix his hairdo for his uh, uh, uniform for his work. Because that is not good. Um, he went to school hungry. Um, they're taking forever to clean up after themselves. And there is a sink in the freaking kitchen, so you can use the sink. Go, go to school. Why isn't anybody using the sink in the kitchen? That makes no sense. I have no idea. But um, before I forget, I do want to put in that fire oven again. Because I adore that thing. And I never ever hardly use it. And since it's in my game again, I might as well use it. So I'm going to go ahead and get it. And customize it of course and I'll go customize his bed as well all right oh snap okay we're gonna have to do that okay we have to go perform that work we have to do that ASAP all right, I want to get the blue color from the ducky wallpaper because it's so cute. Load, 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 please. It's going to take a while. Of course, so how's everybody doing? How you guys liking this Let's Play? Let me know. Um, I'm having issues with YouTube where it doesn't allow me to look at comments. So, if I'm not replying to comments, it's because YouTube is being stupid. 
and I don't understand why it's being stupid. So again, that's the reason why I haven't been replying to you guys' questions or answering or commenting back or whatnot because YouTube is being a complete and utter jerk to me. So yes. All right, so she's going to school just like everyone else is. Um, he has some work to perform. So we need to go do that. So go ahead and patch up the criminals. Why would we patch up the criminals? I don't understand. And we just, okay, he's going to work still. I'm like, we just like left to work for nothing. Like, what the heck? All right. How's the baby doing? And I will be aging her up in three sim days just because I have um, aging and uh, disabled. So Ariel is asked when holding a seminar on the need for proper medical attentiveness both on and off the job it's time to educate all those eager young employees about their health benefits all right i'm gonna go ahead and treat a little bit so he, <laughs> he can be fine during it because i don't want him to like completely fail yay she is pregnant her fifth and final baby yay Okay, change your clothes. Aw, yay! She's pregnant, guys. That's exciting. Even though it's like our 10th and bajillionth uh, sim. So. Ew, I don't like that. Deliver. No, we're not going to Egypt. You're crazy. So I'm going to go ahead and actually trigger his age or her age. So go ahead and trigger age transition and we're going to age Chloe up and then we're going to find Chloe a little mate and um, have her own legacy. Um, hoping, I'm hoping that um, I'm able to have more sims because every time I try, to ha I try to have them try for a baby after she was apparently pregnant but I really didn't see it. Um, I said that there was too many sims in the household so i'm not sure what's going on with that whoa my god i didn't think she was gonna be that big of a dog omg guys <gasps> what is going on chloe what's wrong with your ears chloe why did you why did you turn into being this big of a dog holy holy gosh holy holy gosh we gotta change out your bed because you're not gonna fit on that bed no more <laughs> i was not expecting chloe to big be that big of a dog holy tremoli um i want to be in this uh little corner there we go holy cow dude can you get into this can i put away your toys and you can still be get into this okay yeah sweet i can put your toys away awesome i was not expecting chloe to be bi this big guys we may have to go i'm gonna go ahead and edit sim and create a sim truly really create a pet pretty much and try and fix her ear issues. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Maybe she's just too fluffy for us, smaller for her ears. She is cute, though. She is super cute. Um, so let me go ahead and change up her coat, maybe. Somehow. Let me see. Um... No, I just think it's, just think it's her. Interesting. Go back to her original. There we go. Maybe, maybe if I change her ears up a little bit, can we even change up her ears? I have no idea. Yeah, we can. Oh, 
Oh, Chloe, you're so cute. I think it's just her ears. That's what I'm thinking. Let me go ahead and see if we can change it. Okay. Um. Yeah, it's just her, just her ears. Okay. All right, so how do we get back? Oh, right here. All right, so I guess that's fine. We'll have to deal with it. She's super cute anyways, and she is a monstrous dog, so I was not expecting her to be that big, so I'm not sure if we were going to be able to find a dog that can actually make pretty cute babies with her. So Janelle, let's go ahead and try and adopt a pet. So let's see. Uh, services. Duh. Adopt a pet from the shelter. Can't believe she's pregnant again. During a break, Errol showed how to properly use the whatever maneuver and on a poor employee but everyone was grateful for the demonstration and laughs um demand excellence or you'll get meteoros whatever i can't read guys just i should not read anything to you guys it's probably annoying she wants to have a girl again um i guess we can have another girl because we do have three boys. So I guess we can go get some more watermelon. And have her have a girl. Um, after this. So I'm going to go ahead and let this load. Alright. So look at little Niji. Oh my god. It's an elder though. So it looks like we have Zoe. And everyone else is a puppy. I guess we can get a puppy and just age him up. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get, mm, either Turtle, Lucky, or Jack. Small dog, skittish, destructive, genius, destructive. Let's go ahead and get Turtle. I think he's the cutest, so. And we're going to name it Turtle. Until you guys tell me a good name for him. Alright, guys. So, once Turtle gets here, I'm going to go ahead and end this part right here. Um, oh, yay. Chloe can go up and down the stairs. And now she doesn't have to have us waiting on her hand and foot. Yay. That's a good... Chloe's so cute. I can't get over her. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward it. He should be out soon, along with everybody else. Um, Lawrence Loom is coming home after school with June Hudson. Okay. Fine. It's not like we need other people in our household. <laughs> or our ho house. We have enough as it is. Enough people as it is. Um, all the teenagers will be taking, yeah, sure, go for it. Sign up for an after school activity, go on a field trip. Uh, throw a slumber party, sign up for an after school activity. All right, so we're going to go ahead and actually let them sign up for an after school activity. Um, he is actually currently going to be our inventing, inventing person or whatever. But it's going to take him quite some time to get used to it. But she needs to um, do the laundry. Um, oopsies. Alright, so once he gets out, I'm going to go ahead and have him... Alright. While a little unpleasant, Ariel has probably saved the hospital from several infection cases and improved the quality of life for a few underworlds 
why do uh, that doesn't make any sense few underworld figures it's not high profile but saving lives often isn't all right so we're gonna go ahead and invite her out um lucas spanks or funks after school sure um invite out and we're gonna go ahead and go to the park oh turtles there yay turtle turtle <gasps> turtle is so cute oh my gosh guys oh turtle 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 oh when does he age up in seven days so i'll be aging him up because i do have age disabled of course so all right so we're gonna go ahead and end this part right here so i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you guys have a awesome awesome day and i will talk to you guys all in oh wait peanut would like to come out and play of course marcel where are you going let's wait until we put peanut on the um put peanut on the floor yeah. All right. Gonna fast forward as fast as we can. I don't understand why. Whoa. Hello, baby. <laughs> He's like running like, shut up, sister. I don't care. Look at Peanut. <gasps> oh, I want him to pick up the pet first. Oh, snap. We should probably pay our bills. 1,000 simoleons. I knew it was going to be expensive to live in this house, but I didn't think it was going to be that expensive. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Yee! Yay! Peanut! Yay! You're alive! That's super exciting. Um, I'm going to make her into a, a, uh, a girl, though, because that's who he's going to date. It's going to be super cute, I think, anyways. So I'm going to go ahead and end this part right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye, everyone.